Does anybody not know what he's supposed to do? Raise your hand. Okay. Paolo, why you don't know? Because I was not here. Oh, is that a good argument or no? Do you think that's a good argument or not? <laughs> you look at me funny. Well, do you think the fact of not being here is in any way a good argument or not? Yes, I think so. You, you think so? You sure that? Are you sure of that? It's called Japanese humor. Are you sure of that? <laughs> why? This is funny. Why the Taro? Who knows why Taro is looking at me like this? With this funny face he's making at me. Who knows why? Nobody knows why? Yeah, a couple of people. Ask somebody, why am I making funny faces to Oscar? <laughs> Ask him, why am I making funny faces? <laughs> why do I make funny faces to Oscar? Why am I making funny uh, face? Is Is it true you're ashamed? No. No, tell him that's not true. That's not true. Who has another explanation? Ask somebody else. <coughs> because you didn't understand what Waskas was saying. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Is it my words you don't understand? <coughs> Really? Which word you did not understand? <laughs> Which word? Yes. Um, because I didn't understand what No, wait a minute. Let's, let's, hmm? Is it some words you did not understand? Yes, of course. Which word? I don't remember. You don't remember? Okay, I'll give you the words again. Do you think it's a good argument to say, I don't know because I was not there? Which word you don't understand? I understand. Now. Every word. Yeah. So? So I said, yes, I think so. But before, why did you make funny face? I they were the same words. Mm. Yeah. <coughs> I understood the words, but I didn't see uh, your intention. Ah, you see, that's very interesting. Now, you see why you did not understand? Why? Say it again. Because I didn't see the intention. Yes, but you could understand what I was saying. Yes. But because you say you don't know my intention, you say I don't understand. Mm -hmm. But could you have answered my question without knowing my intention? Or did you have to know my intention? To answer without knowing. I could answer without knowing you. Okay. And by the way, that's a very interesting thing. That's a you know, I've noticed that people not understanding. That's why I always like to say, why is it not understanding? It's not uh, uh, so obvious because the word language, but that's a typical word. People say, I don't understand because they want an intention. So they're not here. When you're in the intention, where are you? Are you in the present? Is intention in the present? Where is it? Just where is it? Yes, I know, but intention, does it deal with the present or with something else? You don't know. Present or somewhere else? You know present, you know, in time, there's present. You know present? Have you said in Japanese? Genzai. Who agrees with the translation of Genzai to present? Raise your hand. Okay, good. So, we'll take it. So, intention, is that in the present or not? Or you yes, don't it know. is present. It yeah. is present. The intention, that's the present. Yeah. In terms of time, yes. Okay. What well, is the intention that's in the present? Raise your hand. We think present is another time thing. Raise your hand. And ask someone, when is the present? Ask, when is, uh, sorry, intention. <laughs> when is intention? Ask. Who, who think intention is not present in the present? Raise your hand. Sorry. Ask somebody. What is intention all about if it's not present? Ask them. Uh, from, from Ask him. Could you explain me? Could you could you explain me if intention is present? Is not present. Is not present. When is it? When is it present? Intention is in the future. Yes. Makes sense to you or no? No. No. Makes no sense. Yeah? I don't agree. No, I, 
I'm, I'm not if you agree. <laughs> don't no worry, agree. I'm talking about understanding. Yeah, I understand. You understand. It's not okay. Not Why is he saying that? Do you know? No. So do you understand it? Yeah, I understand his answer. But, I but does it mean? Do you do you know what it means that intention is in the future? Or you don't know what it means? Literally, yes. Huh? Literally, yes. But can you give content to it? He said. Can you give content? To content. This? No. Yes. What's content? Content. Contenu. No. Meaning. Significant. Yes. yes. Can you do this? I know that. I know that. <laughs> Is it my intention again that you're conscious? <laughs> yeah. Can you give content to this? You know, the idea, again, I, I come back to this thing of Kant, I mentioned often, between uh, concept and intuition. Mm -hmm. Yes, you understand the concept, but if you cannot give content to it, it means nothing to you. It's like somebody says an apple. Okay, apple, yes, I didn't know how to try that in French, but suppose I've never seen an apple. Yes, I know it's a word, it's a fruit, but. I don't know what that is, you know? Then often we hear, especially philosophers, we hear words, yes, the words, okay, I, but I don't know what it's talking about, yes? So he says, when you have a concept, you have to be able to put some intuition, some meaning into it, and the reverse too, when you have a, a, a concrete example, you have to be able to, to give a concept to it. At least, uh, that's one of the key aspects, what I call the dialectical thinking. So, right now you understand the form, but not the content, what he's saying, right? Mm -hmm. So this has no real meaning for you, to say the intention is in the future. Does it have meaning or no for you? Real meaning, with content or no? No. So do you understand him, therefore? I should say no. No. See? And that's why it has a lot to do with what is understanding. Yes? I understand the words, understand what they say, but I don't know what it's talking about. Yes? Mm -hmm. yes. And now you can call that the perf I prefer to say, that is not to understand, because I don't know what this is all about. Okay, so, uh, uh, ask him, how can you say that intention is, is in the future? Ask him. How can you say that intention is in the future? Uh, because, um, uh, uh, you are thinking forward for what is the reasoning behind Oscar's uh, was what, uh, what he's trying to do with you, and that is not in the present. It will uh, <coughs> probably come over you after uh, the conversation. Okay. Do you understand him or no? Yes. Do you know why he says intention is in the future? Yes. Why? Because um, <coughs> um, I expect something. From okay, st stop that. Stop that. Repeat, uh, repeat the verb. Mm -hmm. The verb is just used. I I, okay, expecting. Future or not? Future. Yes. Okay, so intention is to have to do with the future or not? Yes. That's new to you? Yes. Okay, so it was worth coming to the seminar just for that. Mm -hmm. I discovered intentions by the future. Yes. And in fact, do you encounter this? You, you speak to someone, they say, I don't understand you, simply because they don't know what this is going to take place, but actually they could understand what you're saying. You know that problem. Okay, uh, and that's a very classical one.